Leo, welcome to your April 2021 Love and Relationships reading. Thanks for joining me. My name is Michelle and this is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Leo, let's get started. I'm going to jump right into the, the feminine energy that is around Leo for the month of April. Of course, it's not about gender, it's about the energies. Either side can resonate and of course, if you're cross-watching, this could resonate as a Leo that you're dealing with. So let's have a look at the feminine energy that is around Leo. It's a beautiful card. We have Revelation. Very much like a, a tower moment here. That bolt of lightning. So what is it that's becoming clear, Leo? Is it you? Or is it the other person having an epiphany? A moment of... Uh, Confusion is clearing up in someone's mind. Now let's take a look at the masculine energy. Give us some clues as to what's going on here. For my lovely Leos, let's have a look at the masculine energy of Leo. Okay, let's take a look here. We've got, um, I'm going to take both of them because they kind of came out there together. We've got in, we've got rather, autumn, releasing the old and resting okay and then we have hunter tracking down your fears and your desires so someone is uh, finding the courage within to confront something coming up from the depths mm -hmm. it feels quite uh, powerful actually but leo you can do this if this is you i feel that the energy around you is one of bravery strength courage to get down to to what's been holding you back i get that energy of holding you back something from the past here now there is going to be a time where you need to after this period where you need to take a little bit of a, a rest because this is quite energy sapping uh, going to the depths here really deep diving is what i'm getting from spirit in order to uh, confront some old fears so let's see the uh, connecting energy between the two of you let's take a look of course if you're not dealing with anyone this may resonate uh, as both sides of yourself leo let's look at the connecting energy what is the connecting energy here for leo please spirit guides the connecting energy I really like that hunter because you're getting to you really want to get to it you want to get to what's been holding you back I keep getting that we've got the salmon okay fishing for salmon interesting Let, let's uh, let's talk about uh, what that could represent okay the salmon it is a, a sign of wisdom a sign of intuition it is about well it's it's interesting because salmon are considered magical creatures because they swim in both salt and fresh water a celtic mythology especially valued these fish as the giver of wisdom okay all right so there's an energy here of magic magic around you a time when wisdom is coming to the surface but i feel like it's really being helped along this process of yours of getting to the the bottom of a problem is being helped along by spirit and it may seem quite magical but leo the main thing is that uh, it's really allowing you to tackle something here that has been i feel pushed down like repressed i get this energy of pushing this down repressing it not dealing with it but this tower moment here is really forcing a leo to to deal with an issue okay so let's see where this goes guys i'm going to start with the feminine energy i've already been meditating on these cards but i want to put a little bit more energy into them and uh, then i'll put them down so leo leo this could be you of course you could be dealing with someone who's uh, uh, going through this particularly uh, difficult time and during this time guys if that's the case they may be needing to take some time away from you you may not hear as much from this person at the moment but there's a lot going on 
that they're not speaking about okay so so let's take a look okay one more one more all right better let's see leo feminine energy where the feminine currently stands where they hope to stand in the future how they are feeling about the masculine how they've perceived the masculine in the past doubts and fears What's happening around the feminine that's affecting them and the potential outcome? And uh, let's take a look at the masculine energy. I've been meditating on these cards as well. So a few more shuffles, to put a little bit more energy into these cards. And uh, then we'll get started with the reading, guys. Let's take a look. Masculine energy of Leo, please, spirit guides. Start with their energy where they currently stand <clears throat> excuse me where they hope to stand in the future mm, just take a drink sorry about this guys <coughs> frog in my throat okay get that out Woo. all right how the masculine is feeling about the feminine how they've perceived the feminine in the past their doubts and fears what is happening around the masculine and of course the outcome all right let us take a look here guys i'll put the salmon right in the center feminine energy we have judgment in the reverse okay what i'm getting from spirit here is that there's a need to withhold judgment don't make any decisions yet because this person is going through some kind of uh, process at the moment so I feel it would be too soon to make a judgment call I'm getting autumn now for those of us in the northern hemisphere that's uh, several months away so it may take until the autumn time the fall for this uh, person to uh, to reach this epiphany for those of you in the southern hemisphere it may happen sooner okay now let's take a look at the masculine energy the lovers so this is this is a lover uh, there's definitely a choice to be made regarding this uh, this relationship there's something holding back this masculine that is coming to the surface uh, mm. it's it's quite confronting some kind of conf very personal confrontational it, it, it's not that they're confronting anyone else i feel like this confrontation is, is happening with their fears regarding a love uh, emotional intimacy connections now where the feminine currently stands the four of swords they're needing to take a break needing to take time away it's a time of rest where you may be uh, separated by distance or certainly emotions where the masculine currently stands the nine of pentacles okay there's an energy around this one of needing to really look at what independence means to them what is of value to them really it feels like someone here who has tried to hold on to their independence this masculine energy but there's a need to look deep at why this is important it, it, it feels like it's become a barrier to uh, intimate relationships but let's see where this goes now the uh, the feminine energy their hopes for the future we've got the emperor in the reverse well it's hopes for this masculine energy to uh, to get themselves together to, uh, to to find out what they want you know there's a goodness this masculine energy that i'm feeling around leo at the moment is very <sighs> indecisive you know mix i'm getting a lot of mixed signals from this masculine energy 
Okay, hopes for the future for the masculine. We've got the King of Pentacles. Yeah, so there's strength here. For sure. So what I'm seeing around this is a, this person really wants to get themselves into a place where they feel strong, where they feel like they're in a good position. There could be some financial issues that this person has been needing to tackle. But it feels more like getting their stability back within themselves, knowing what they want. This person, I feel, has been very conflicted at just where they're headed. You know, I'm not getting a lot of direction around this individual. Now, the uh, we've got as the uh, how the feminine feels about the masculine. We've got the fool in reverse. Well, it's this kind of carefree recklessness, not really knowing what they want. You know, this could be general guys as well. It doesn't have to be a particular person. It could be masculine energy. Because I am getting that, that this might be more than one person that you're dealing with here, Leo. Uh, men who just don't know what the heck they want. A kind of very scattered, very fragmented energy. And are not really dealing with... Um, Dealing with their issues, dealing with their stuff. How the uh, masculine feels about the feminine. Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, it's a. It feels very much uh, an energy here of. I'm getting hedonism. Uh, I don't know why I'm getting that. It feels like being stuck with uh, the focus being on uh, pleasure in the moment, but not really having their eye on the future not really being directed towards a goal necessarily but just kind of very laissez-faire like oh let's just take it as it comes um, uh, we're lovers aren't we isn't that enough that that kind of energy how the feminine has perceived the masculine in the past the king of cups in reverse well basically emotionally all over the place there's a feeling here of not being in, in in charge of their emotions I'm getting. Addictions for some. There is a, a feeling here of uh, being very uh, emotionally manipulative, uh, controlling. How do they do that? By withholding, I feel. By withholding the emotional aspect. Just coming in saying, oh, I... Uh, you know, the, the lover's aspect, it, they may have wanted to keep this quite uh, sexualized while maintaining this independence, you know. Uh, very, it feels very compartmentalized, guys. Um, this masculine energy, uh, compartmentalizing. Their emotions are not even present at the moment. It feels like uh, the sex, the focus is there, yes, but sporadically. And their main goal seems to be about uh, maintaining their independence and uh, and growing their finances. Okay, let's see. How the um, masculine has perceived the feminine in the past, the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Well, not putting any... Uh, they felt like they didn't have the uh, motivation. They weren't motivated to put effort in. Okay, let's see. The fears for the feminine is the Eight of Cups in reverse, going round and round in circles, not getting anywhere. It feels like being stuck in a time loop, either with the same person or maybe even just dating people who are kind of, I get, gosh, not putting any effort in, guys. Fears for the masculine, we've got Knight of Wands in reverse, so there's a lack of commitment just in general. Very non-committal. Let's see. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles in reverse as the environment, guys. Yeah. Oh, whew, wow. Leo, if, if, if this is you uh, uh, talking about feminine energy, what you've been dealing with here is kind of a lazy ass person i'm sorry to say they, they feel really lazy uh, they feel very um it feels like entitlement uh, 
like they want access to you when they want you but other times you probably don't even hear from them goodness gracious let's see What's happening around the masculine, the seven of wands? Well, you're putting you're putting up a resistance to this. You're saying, no, I'm ha I've had it. You know, I think you put up with it for a while, but mm -mm -mm -mm. this revelation, this epiphany here is you, Leo, saying, to heck with this. I'm not putting up with this kind of laissez-faire, oh, yeah, let's just, let's just um, go with the flow. Let, let's just... Uh, uh, I feel like it's very like sexual kind of energy, but not anything more than that. The outcome for the feminine is the page of pentacles in reverse. Yeah, I think that you're tired of putting any effort at all into this. You're going to let this one go. And for the masculine is the page. <laughs> That's interesting. You both have the page of pentacles. They've got it in the upright. You've got it in the reverse. So suddenly... You not putting any effort in makes him say, oh, hang on, wait a minute. But they're still coming to you with this page energy. I think they want to be this king of pentacles in the future, but they don't feel like they can be there yet. There seems to be hesitancy to commit until they become this king. They feel like they've got some a journey to take, this releasing the old, this energy of tracking down their fears, deciding what it is that they truly want overcoming their fears i feel that like they're reaching out to you in some small way possibly friendship you're going to hear from them you're definitely going to hear from them yeah <sighs> this person needs to wisen up they need to they need to wake up they need to wake up wake up and smell the coffee uh yeah the, the feminine energy you know to be honest with you i'm i feel like you're going to reject this offer because whatever it's coming in as it, it feels very uh, like it's not valuable to you it, it feels like a throwaway like a toss I, I get you like tossing the fish back it's kind of like um fishing and if something if you land the big one you'll 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 reel it in but if you come up with something like this it feels like a, you're going to toss this page back and wait for a king that's what I'm getting now for some you may have to wait until autumn for this person to turn into your king in the meantime I feel like you're just gonna say uh, thanks but no thanks and um, I feel for the feminine energy here it's a question of you know what I'm good I'm good on my own I'm not dealing with fools idiots people who don't put any effort in people who don't know what they have when they have it yeah I, I just get you very clear in what you want and what you don't want and you're not suffering any fools that's what I feel here Leo but let's see where this goes in the extended we'll go into this much more in depth so if this is your story Please do join me. The link is down below, Leo. It'll be about a 30-minute reading. I'll be clarifying, going a lot further uh, in depth and, of course, looking at some future cards for oracles and clarification as well. If you prefer a personal reading, Leo, please email me. My email address is gypsyinsights at gmail.com or you can go to my Etsy shop and purchase directly there. Uh, wishing you the best with this Leo please do like share and subscribe share me on your social media that's the best way you can uh, support my channel right now or there are other ways to do that by even getting early access to the videos and clicking and uh, clicking on the uh, the join button down below for ways to uh, to look at uh, getting early access to my readings wishing you the best at this Leo please do take care and thanks again bye for now